Good morning, guys. I'm trying to get going. I woke up at 8, and then I fell right back asleep. <laughs> Until, like, 9.30, and now it's around 10. <sighs> I've just been, like, on Facebook and stuff, so... It's not like I've been getting, sitting here getting stuff done like I should. Uh, yesterday's vlog is going to be fun to edit because Amelia was here. And Austin left this morning. So sad. <sighs> Who am I supposed to cuddle with now? I don't have anybody to cuddle with. My hair is like stupid. <laughs> it's all like flopped backwards. There's my hair. I think I'm just gonna make this a chill day. I think I'm just gonna like try and read. Like maybe I just need to do something different other than art. But at the same time, I should probably get to work on that gift swap picture because we're gonna try and send that before we both go to school, and it has to reach Colorado. So maybe I should just get the gift swap out. So I'm like inspired by seeing it sit there all lonely. And I still have to, uh, type up a letter or handwrite it. I don't know what, what I'm gonna do yet. I don't know. I need to go on to Walgreens, too, because I haven't finished Amelia's other, um, Christmas present. I mean, I showed her what it was yesterday, but it's just, it's pretty much a frame. And then, um... It's a frame, and then you, uh, this is like friends, and then friendship, and then it just says friends all the way around it, and like, it can either go this way or this way, because the text flips, so, yeah, and it's just like cheaper than therapy on it and stuff, it's just really cute. And I got matching ones, so she could have one and I could have one, and I have the two pictures on a blue flash drive up on my desk. And I'm going to go to Walgreens today, hopefully, and get those printed. Like, I was at Austin's until 3 the night before. Last night. And then last night, I was up until probably 2. So, I don't know why I'm so tired today. <laughs> I still woke up at a decent time. <sighs> when I opened my eyes, I'm like, oh god, it's gonna be noon, and half my day's gonna be gone. But no, it's only 10. <laughs> you guys seriously need to try this stuff. It is so good. Like, it doesn't have any chunks in it. It's pretty much just flavored, like, berries. It's, like, purple. And it tastes amazing on bagels. Dad went to the grocery store and got mini bagels and goldfish. Like, my two favorite things. You guys. <laughs> so, I was planning to dye my hair sometime before school started and now like okay i have highlights but they're so grown out like they're not even on top of my head anymore when i pull my hair back they're so grown out and i have to get them redone and i couldn't get an appointment with linda before um february 7th so i'm not gonna be able to dye my hair blue until after february 7th Do you see my problem? So now, like, I wanted to make a statement. I wanted to stand out in all my new classes and have my, you know, freshly dyed blue hair. Now it's gonna look like crap. <laughs> and now it's just gonna look like crap until, like, after the 7th. And then probably after the 7th, I won't dye my hair right away. Because, I mean, I should be able to because it's, like... It's my old highlights. It's not like it's my brand new highlights I'm going to be dying because I'm only going to get a touch-up. I'm not going to do my whole head again. I still have highlights in the back. In the, like, from here down is highlights. <laughs> this makes me sad. I won't have fresh blue hair for school. I'm kind of having to just dye it anyway because I have two boxes of dye and I hardly need any dye for my hair because I only do the tips. So I'm kind of tempted to just like do it anyway. <laughs> Because it'll, I go back to school on January 20th, and my appointment isn't even until February 7th. But she's probably going to trim my hair, 
so I'm gonna have to redye it anyway, and that's the worst part. <laughs> oh my god, guys, help. I'm so addicted. <laughs> I have two grandmas, seven cursors, almost 1,100 cookies, and I have all these things to unlock, and I have so many achievements, and it's just like, ugh, why have I not found, like, <laughs> Like, I heard people talk about this, and I'm like, that's stupid. Why would you just want to click all the time? But I get it. Like, you get all these uh, you get all these things that, like, automate your cookies, and then you forever get cookies. And then, like, and then like the more you click, the faster it goes up, and you get a cookie per click. So it's like, oh my god, why is it so addicting? I clicked the golden cookie, and it's making me 588 cookies a second. But it's running out of time. <laughs> I have all these upgrades now. <laughs> I'm so addicted. Oh, it's such a problem. And I'm watching Daily Bumps in the background. Is, uh, so addicted. <laughs> 3 point almost 7 million cookies. And I haven't even touched it. Booyah. Look at all my like factories and mines and all my grandmas making cookies. Mom and I are going to print out pictures. She has a frame that Austin got her for Christmas that she's gonna put pictures in. So she asked me to get a few pictures off my camera or off my phone. That's the word. <laughs> off my phone for her to use to put the pictures in. And I'm gonna finally get the marker to finish Belle. And I'm bringing this because over here I think I have a coupon fall. Yep, I have a coupon for 20% off my complete purchase. So I'll probably use uh, my, the I don't want to say the rest, but a lot of my uh, Visa gift card I have, because I still have like 70-ish dollars on that. So yeah, I don't know, I've been contemplating getting the Copic case like a big black case. It's really sturdy. It's really nice. And it has pet and it has like pouches inside to hold Copics because this is overflowing. This thing I have over here overflowing with markers. I'm having to put them in the middle section and then I forget where, that I put those in the middle section cuz it's like indented, so it's like further down, so I forget they're in there. <sighs> so, I think it's just going to be easier if I just get a new um, thing to hold my markers. So, I'm contemplating it. I might just end up doing it. I don't know. But I got one on Amazon for $83 instead of 100 <laughs> But this is 20% off, so it would be about that price anyway with tax. So, whatever. Up to 4 million cookies. You guys, I caved. I went and got the Copic case I wanted. It's a really nice, sturdy case. It was a hundred dollars, but I had a coupon, and I also got the two markers I needed. So my total was one hundred fifteen dollars, but I had a twenty percent off coupon, so that made it twenty three dollars cheaper. So I got. The $100 case and two $8 markers for $99. Under $100 for a $100 case and two $8 markers. So if I wouldn't have used my coupon, it would have been like $116. Austin and I are going to Skype tonight. He moved down there today. And he's all alone today, I think. None of his roommates have moved in yet. So I'm going to Skype him tonight. So... Maybe I'll be able to vlog something. I don't know. He gets mad when I vlog. So, Yeah, and the yesterday's episode with Amelia, I totally just it left my mind that the songs would be copyrighted. So it might just be a silent video of us dancing. And I'm really sorry. Maybe if it is silent. I acknowledged it because it said it was like unavailable in some countries because of the music. So... I'm going to try, I mean, I think you can still listen to the music, it's it's acknowledged, so I think it's still there, but 
I might have to put some music over it, like some free music or something, just so it doesn't look stupid. <laughs> um, but yeah, that was the only problem with yesterday's, besides it was like 27 minutes long, which that's not a bad thing either. I honestly don't remember vlogging a good night clip for that. I don't remember. I mean, I think I did. I'm pretty sure I did. I don't remember. It was really late at night. It was like 2 in the morning. <sighs> I need to stop. I need to just like stop staying up late. <laughs> Mom just went into Walgreens to go get our pictures and uh, a few other things that we needed. So I'll be going home. Finishing Bell. Probably going to sketch uh, the gift swap picture because I really need to get that done. Because we were both hoping to get it sent out before we went to college. So maybe we could get it before we went to college. But I don't think that's going to work. I don't think that's going to happen. Just because I need to make a 8x10 picture for her. And I haven't even gotten it sketched yet. I know the characters I want in it. I just haven't gotten it sketched. So... Yeah. <laughs> um... And I've had to, I've had the hankering to read since last night, but I'm not gonna end up reading because that <laughs> good feeling's gone. Um, but yeah, I'm excited. I got the case I wanted. It's so pretty. It's a lot smaller than I remember, but that could have just been because I thought it was the best thing in the world when I saw it, so I thought it was bigger. But it comes with a shoulder strap, so see, like connect velcros together. Eh trying to open it but it's a nice zipper this is a very nice sturdy case and I really like it the zippers a little oh that's because the tag was in it and inside you can't even see it but inside it has like some mesh little cubbies I can put my markers in I'm struggling so hard right now but on the inside, it has some mesh little cubbies I can put my markers in. And I'm kind of we weary about those because, I mean, it was a $100 case. And it has flimsy little, you know, pouches inside that probably aren't even going to hold my markers. So that's the only beef I had about this case. Otherwise, it's perfect for, like, sitting underneath my desk when I need it. So I'm excited, and I got it for... 20% off pretty much, so I love it. Right now, it just looks like cheese. Noodles! My mom made like homemade noodles and company, pretty much. If you don't have a noodles and company around you, it's pretty much this awesome like pasta place where you get pretty much just a bowl of buttered noodles. And they have a lot of different options you can choose from, like, I always get the Wisconsin mac and cheese, which is pretty much what this is. It's pretty much just shredded cheese on top of really hot butter noodles. And you stir it up and it makes it all good and gooey and stuff. And then, um, like, other options, like, you can have tofu in it. You pretty much just start off with butter noodles, and then you tell them what kind of butter noodles you want, pretty much. Like, you can add... You can have meat. You can choose what kind of meat you want. You can have tuna. You can just have plain butter noodles if you want. And they have just a lot of good stuff there. But Noodles & Company is over in Davenport across the river. And I don't feel like driving across the river just for a bowl of noodles. I can just easily make it at home. Or have my mom make it in this case. So now I pretty much have just mac and cheese with a bunch of cheese on my spoon because it got stuck. Yeah. Okay guys, my mouth is like watering right now because round two I put ranch on my noodles and I have these bacon ritz left over and bacon ranch pasta sounds pretty damn good, so pretty stoked about it. <laughs> then after I'm done eating I'm gonna start Finally finishing Bell, so hope maybe Monday I can finally mail those two boxes and get them out of here. Finally getting back to work on this Bell picture. It desperately needs it because, I mean, I don't have that much left to even do on it. I'm gonna probably, like, cut it a little closer to her and just make it a square format and sign it somewhere, so... 
I really just have the yellow left and I'm done. And a few highlights in her eyes and other places, so. Yep, should get done. And then I can finally send those boxes off. That shirt's for my brother, by the way. It's a fish, and then on the bottom, like over here, it says, I'm a hooker on the weekends. It's it's me and my brother. Just, <laughs> shh, it's fine. But yeah, this is the section I just did with my new marker. And it, I think it looks better because toward this area, my base color Y13 was drying out and I had to like scrub it just to get any sort of yellow on there. So yeah, long time waiting, but I'm finally getting it done. Hey guys, so I just got off Skype with Austin and now I'm like super tired. <laughs> so I think I'm just gonna chill out and then go to bed because... It's almost midnight, and I'm still awake, so I should probably try and go to sleep anyway. Um, I got all, I got my thing all packed up with my coat books, and I don't have room for, like, more stuff over here. Right now I have a picture of me and Amelia over there, and two pictures of me and my grandpa, and my candle. So there's just a lot more room up there. It looks a lot better. And I moved my nutcrackers into my closet. So I, just, I have a lot more room now that that's going to be on the floor. And I only filled up two and a half of the little mesh baskets. I'll show you guys tomorrow. Like every how it all situates in there. But I still don't know where to really put my multi-liners and like my erasers and stuff right now they're just all kind of like thrown in the rest of the mesh baskets but i'd like to keep those as empty as possible i'm gonna end it here guys so thanks for watching i'll see you guys tomorrow